Hi, my name's Andrew Smith and I survived. Can't really believe it. This is video number two and yes I survived video number one. And as I admitted in my first video, I'm scared, damn scared of doing this. I don't mind saying that it's been really tough standing here. I've come to a quiet spot here, as I said, between a, a rock and a hard place down there in Hong Kong. I don't think you see it in the background yet. And uh, <coughs> yeah, I've survived. I'm here creating videos now. I've got to get practice. I've got a video course I want to get out and finish by the end of the month. And I've got to start somewhere. And these couple of videos are me getting past all that procrastination that I mentioned yesterday or earlier, because it was earlier. Um, it feels like yesterday. <laughs> the fear of getting up to make video number two. I had to go for a walk around the block, well, around the rock, have a drink, stroked a dog as it passed, it made me feel a bit better. What one has to do to build up courage to do things that are outside your box. You know, take that one step further. Just try something a bit different. Entertaining a thousand people shouting, screaming on a stage. I can do that. Getting up there, talking on a TEDx stage. I can do that. I've done it twice, three times I've been on TEDx stage. Frightening at the time. It's just getting past it. The procrastination is very easy to to do and to keep going. With a TEDx, you've got an event, you have a deadline, you have to be there, you have to turn up, you get ready and doing it. With a video course, you can stick it at the back of the filing cabinet and wait and wait and wait until everything is right, which it will never be. So why am I doing this now? Why is it not in the back of the filing cabinet? or the bottom of my to-do list. Well, I've set myself a deadline of getting the course completed and out the door by January the 30th. That gives me 10 days to get used to talking to camera, get the video editing sorted. I've done that, I've been practicing that. That was a good bit of uh, procrastination as well. The microphone seems to be working, unfortunately. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm there, I'm going forward. As I say, my name is Andrew Smith. My superpower is that I help people differentiate themselves from their competitors so they stand out, that they can charge more than their competitors, between four and six times the competitors. We're in a very, very busy competitive world and I come from a very competitive industry, the entertainment industry. And I managed to position myself where I was, or I am, able to charge four to six times my competitors' fees for pretty much offering a very similar service. And from a sales and marketing background, I've been able to use my marketing and sales skills to, to position myself where I'm different from my competitors in my client's eyes. And I come across a lot of people who are in business who need to or could certainly use the benefit of coaching, help, advice to position themselves so that they're no longer competing on price and that they're out there achieving what life truly offers them and what they truly deserve for the work that they put in learning their skills. And I'm here to help you. So this is Andrew signing off for video number two and uh, good luck and please reach out and shout, shout out if I can help you in any way and please 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 take courage from what I'm doing here today is stepping outside my zone and talking to this video camera I hate it absolutely hate it well I did I'm feeling better all around it already the first one uh, nearly an hour ago now it's quite tough to do. This one, as I say, I've chilled, feeling a bit more relaxed. I hope it's coming over that, that way. 
and um, yeah I'll speak to you soon in video number three where bah, I'll have it all sorted and uh, we'll be uh, flying with no ums ahs and repetition well maybe some repetition there might be some repetition in it as well but yeah we'll see but until the next repeat bye for now <laughs>